Okay, we have this one. And then we have this one. This one's for a buddy of mine getting in the racing. Basically, John Deere hood. It's got Toro fenders that I cut down the middle. Re welded them. I took four inches out of the actual fenders itself. Cut four inches out and brought the front back to the rear. And just kind of stitch welded it together. Middle, I'm not going to worry about because I'm going to cut the fenders down the middle, and a lot of this is going to be gone, so I don't really care about the gap. Here's the tires, bumper, everything's pretty much on there. The brake system, the MCP caliper, EC quick change hub with a uh, changeable sprocket. I've got one of my old burnt out, bald Hoosier tires. That's what they should look like. That's the right rear off my blue one. It's got a BMI 14 inch steering wheel. I've got number plates made for them, but I had to take it off. I had to make my brake mount for my caliper. The hood pivots completely forward for complete access to the engine compartment. I don't have the motor in there now. Clutch. The motor plates. Fully tubed inside the chassis. Steering. It's a gear drive steering system. Works pretty good. It's very smooth. Gets rid of the bar steer. That's uh, pretty much what I'm at so far. Fenders aren't done yet. I've just got to cut them down the middle and widen them. But other than that, though, that's kind of what I have so far on it. Hopefully to get it done before uh, next season so he can get start to run uh, run this. I'm going to put them together in Intech Twin for now until he's got the money to put himself a motor together. That's what the rear, rear end is going to look like. I haven't done that side because the fenders haven't been widened yet. They've only been shrunk to the 8-inch wheels. But that's, uh, that's